by your call. What's up, YouTube? Back with Bo's Roof Life with another review <clears throat> on the new Ice Cap 1K dryer flow pump. Wow, nobody cares about the box. This thing has been released just a few weeks ago. I got this off of Bulk Reef Supply. I wanted one really bad just because I think the circulation's a lot better on these than just a regular straight ahead flow. This goes, if you put it at the, you know, in the corner of your tank, you can, it goes around on your sand and everything, gets them, you know, just a lot better flow. You can set them up different ways too. Uh, let's open up this thing. I know on the site it says max flow is 100, I mean, for a 100 gallon tank, minimum's 20 gallons. Let's see here, we got the owner's manual. <clears throat> So this, this, this here will tell you more about the product if you um, don't already know about it. Dangerous. Do not eat. No one's going to eat this shit. What do they think you're going to do? Wow. Well, in the trash that goes. Unless you do want to eat it. Okay, so here we got the um, dryer pump itself. You got the magnet right here has a piece of little foam in between it so you don't you know accidentally smash them together and then it's hard to get back off so there's that here's the screen the monitor it actually looks pretty good actually it has this little turn thing it's how you can turn it up i guess from like zero to a hundred percent flow with you know the, the max flow or the minimum flow and you can program this thing to 24 hours. You can make it do like 5% right now, and it'll get, it'll increase during the day. You can have it full blast all day. Pretty, pretty nice. I like how it's programmable. It's really nice. These really cheap ones you can buy off Amazon for like 15 bucks. That's the ones I used to have. Yeah, they're just constant flow, no change, no nothing. So this, at least you can program it. You know, it's really nice. And it has, I'm pretty sure it has, let's see here five flow modes and then it has let's see here 24 hour programmable cycle like I said twin directional flow cases here's some end caps and stuff that can go on the end, end of the dryer on the end of them and a few parts inside this power brick and here's a cable that goes into the power brick and into the wall. All right. Well, that's enough with the video. I'm going to get this thing plugged up, and I'm going to let y'all see how it works. Um, I, have, I have never tried it out, never tried out one at all. So we'll see how it works. I'll be back with y'all in just a little bit. So here is the drawer inside the tank. Magnet on the back. It don't take up a lot of room at all. And here's the monitor down here. I got a mounted steel, but um, it's at 100% right now. And um, you can set the time and everything on this. You can do constant flow, pulsing flow, and everything on this thing. But I'm going to mount it on the wall right below my Reef Octopus pump. So it does a good job. I mean, you can, I can tell it's coming out there. And everybody says they're really loud, but. I really don't hear anything. I like it a lot. If y'all got any questions or anything, y'all just leave a comment below. I ain't got just a regular power head over there, but good circulation now. Thanks for watching the video. I hope y'all liked it. Play